Is there a best part to being a star at such a young age? I mean, that is in, a, in your teens. Um, I don't know. Probably, probably like, uh, probably getting to do odd things that, that not many youngsters get to do, like uh, going to award ceremonies and things, and uh, that's pretty fun. That's the upside. The, the downside for you? Um, I don't know. There's, uh, you get, you get bothered sometimes when it's at the times that are inappropriate, but I think that that's, uh, I mean, that's, it's kind of that balance, you know, for every cool, new, neat thing you get to do, you have something that's kind of odd. But I don't, I don't think that there's anything, you have to kind of avoid going, you know, like, to Luke Perry malls and things, but, you know, other than that, you're, you're pretty fine. The common perception is that a young person like yourself does not have a quote-unquote normal life. Yes, no? Well, um, no, no, it's not a normal life, but I don't think it's a bad, I don't think it's the bad side of normal. It's very different. Uh, uh, I definitely can't do a lot of normal things, but again, I get to do some, some bizarre things that no one, that many, even adults don't ever get to do. So, uh, uh, I mean, I think that it's a give and take sort of thing. I, I didn't lead a normal childhood. I didn't. I wasn't in school all the time and stuff. But I, but I gathered the same, a different, but but an equal sort of education. Uh, so you know, I, I think that I don't. I, it's definitely not normal. I couldn't. I couldn't say that it's normal. But it's it's not bad. It's 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 fairly exciting. Is it easier to meet girls, you know, when you're on TV or not? What's the the upside downside? I would say it's not, because in a normal situation, you would go to a, a, a place where there would be a lot of people your own age, a lot of peers, and you would theoretically not have uh, high morals, and so you'd just go and just talk to someone, and make a fool of yourself, or whatever, and, and uh, ask them out on a date, or whatever, and if they, and, and it's just two people, and if not, nothing clicks, then you move on to the next person. And in, my, in, in a situation like mine, you can't exactly do that. I mean, you can't exactly just jump into a place where there's a bunch of your peers, because already then it's kind of, you're getting noticed already. And then to just go up and ask someone out is kind of weird, because you don't know whether they're going to go out with you for bad reasons, or whether they, you know, it's, it, it's bizarre. So you kind of have to either, either meet people who, uh, who understand your situation. That's why a lot of people date in the industry, I guess, or, uh, or just happen to click with somebody that you, that you get to know more on a friendship basis and then it becomes something else. But I have, I have great trouble just going to a club and meeting some chick, talking to her. But I guess maybe that's a personal dilemma, so I don't know. The transition from young adult actor to, you know, into your 20s and all of that is sometimes a rough transition for, for folks. Um, how do you, is there a game plan or how are you approaching that? Well, I, I want to be in this profession for a while. I'm in this business, uh, not necessarily, maybe not even necessarily as an actor, but in, in some facet I want to be involved. And I think a, a lot of kids that try and make that transition weren't initially in it for that reason. They thought it would be cool to be famous and, and to have, uh, to be in teen magazines and things. Uh, but I, I mean, I, ever since I was a little kid, I wanted to act. And I and I and I didn't think it would happen this soon, and I didn't want it necessarily to happen this soon. I mean, when it did, it was an opportunity that anyone would would uh, leap on. But but uh, I just wanted to to be in the business. I mean, all my life, and so it happened, and it was great. But but now that I look back and think, I mean, when I was in in you know elementary school and mid school, what I was thinking about what I wanted to do, and and it would have been you know, to act. So it wasn't like I thought, wow, I want to be a kid famous star and see what that's like. So hopefully that'll, you know, that'll keep it going uh, enough that in, in the, in future years, I hope to, you know, act more or direct maybe. And uh, that's kind of a common line, but I, I do like, I do like the whole directorial side of everything. Uh, I kind of see things that way. So, you know, we'll see. I would, I would definitely hope to, even if I don't, even if it's not professionally, I'd like to keep acting in some sort of, you know, community theater or, or however locally or whatever. I mean, I, I think that that will be what I end up doing for a while. I hope so.